Eric, we really appreciate you taking us out here ice climbing. Uh, I know that just because we've been friends for a while, uh, you used to guide a lot. And these days, you, you've climbed Everest, you've done a bunch of the seven summits. If people wanted to come out and ice climb, on their own, like what, uh, well, maybe not on their own, but if yeah, they went with yeah. a guide, like what would you suggest? Uh, yeah, if people are wanting to come to Vail and climb, I would recommend looking at Apex Mountain School, getting on with a guide there, learn. They've got great instructors and guides. They could take people out. Uh, I'm available for people that are kind of friends of friends, you know? <laughs> yeah. But I, I'm not guiding so much right now. Uh, I do still climb a lot with my good friend Eric Weinmayer. You know, he's the blind friend of mine who summited Mount Everest with yeah. me. And, we were out just here the other day climbing ice, so we still get out a lot, and I still do en enjoy it. I've wow. even had my twin daughters out ice climbing. They're really? 10 wow. years old. Yeah. yeah. <laughs> That's awesome. Well, speaking of the uh, of taking out Eric, I mean, you've gone on some pretty epic adventures yourself. Right? Yeah, I mean, yeah. We, we read in your book, The Summit, that you were climbing in the Himalayas, a peak called Amand de Blanc, and yeah. you took a huge fall. Yeah. Tell us about that. Yeah. So that was a training climb for Everest. I went there with Eric, and we had a small team, and we got caught in a storm and the summit wasn't gonna happen. So we were descending. And on that descent, I unclipped from the fixed lines. I was steps away from my tent. And then a rock just sh moved under my feet and I fell on it and then I fell over. Wow. It was a 600 foot cliff. I fell 150 feet of it. And uh, thank the Lord, I landed on my feet and had no broken bones. That's kind amazing. of a miracle, that's, really. That's incredible. <laughs> yeah, wow. so I, I figured uh, God has plans you know, for my life that it wasn't over at that moment. Yeah, yeah. wow. But I uh, came back and summited Everest with Eric the next year and uh, nearly lost my life on Amit Blom. And in fact, Eric invited me to go back to it this fall. So really? we may just go do that. Wow, wow. That's, yeah. that's an incredible story. That's Man. amazing. Well, yeah. we really appreciate it. And uh, next time we come out here, I kind of think maybe climbing this thing could be uh, pretty cool. Just kind of the next step doing this. I mean, this thing is, <laughs> Awesome. Yeah, this is 120 feet high. This uh -huh. would definitely be the next step for you guys if you come back. Okay. Yeah. This is the rigid designator. It'd be a lot of fun. That's awesome. <laughs> well, really, we really appreciate it. Yeah. And, uh, yeah, thanks again. Yeah, All right. Thanks. Nice climbing with you guys. Yeah, you too.